Hello guys, my name is Shaima. So today I will teach you how to create LED lights on the curve wall. Okay, first go to customize, then go inside ceiling function. You can double click on the wall. Okay, select the rectangle. You can see here inside the structure layer properties. Okay, then draw rectangle in the middle. Okay, select it and move it down a bit because we don't want it to overlap with the floor. Alright. Select the rectangle and change the chamfer. You go to chamfer setting. Untick the batch edit first. Okay. Change the type to outer fillet. Change the radius to 500 or you can put your own dimension. Okay. Change both left and right. Like this. Okay. Now select the outer rectangle here. Change the off the wall to 800 so the wall will come out like this. Okay. Now select the middle rectangle. Go to edge strip or right click edge strip. You can see this section added. Okay. Now go to section library. Okay. You go to lamp tube. Down here. Right. Drag lamp tube inside the box here. Right. Now go to free mode. Here you can adjust the light first. Okay, so this is our light. Adjust it. Okay, now click the generate light strip. It will come out like this. So here you drag it down. You can position it. The way you want this one is like the top view of the wall okay this is a light intensity you can change or you can change the thickness also all right okay down here is the light intensity as well you can change the light color also right okay so this is the light color when you render, it will come out this color. Lah. Okay. This one, move it front a bit. Okay, change the thickness. Adjust the light intensity. Okay, set the light color. Alright, here you can adjust the position a bit. Okay, now done. So this is how it looks like. Okay, that's another method I want to show you. This one we're going to use free modeling function. You can go to floor plan and go inside free modeling. Okay, so first step is to draw rectangle on the floor. Right, now stretch it up to the ceiling height. Okay, next we're going to draw another rectangle in the middle. Okay. Next, you can draw arc on the edge here. If you have your own radius, you can put your own radius. Lah. Okay. Next, you can delete this line. Select it and delete it. Okay. Then you go down. Go down here, select the bottom surface and stretch it down to 100 or maybe to 200 because we don't want it to overlap with the floor. Right, now select the rectangle here, go to loft function, select the brown tube or the lamp tube. Then stretch the rectangle to 200, okay, select it. Then do loft one more time, okay, select the tube. Then stretch it again to 200, okay, one more time, do loft function. Right, select the tube, then stretch it. The last time is 200. So this is how it looks like. Okay, so you go return. But if you render this, the light won't come out. It will only show the line. So now go to cloud, 
and put fill lights to the LED tube here. Okay, fill light the function is to give lighting when you render. All right. So here you can try adjust the position. Okay, you can press X button to rotate it, or you can press C button to resize it. Okay, this one X. Oh, sorry, C button. Okay. Press C button, then resize it. Then you can copy this fill light to the other side. Okay, you guys can try out. So thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe our channel.